Welcome to Magic Gathering Strat. I'm Dan and I'm just doing a thought experiment here. What if I took the Delver shell and just replaced a lot of stuff uh, with the Stealer of Secrets, uh, Scroll Thief and Ophidian and then just tried to draw a ton of cards. So I've taken out the Delvers because I have less spells, I've taken out all the card draw and replaced it with creatures and I put in both Vapor Snags and Snaps. Uh, so the sideboard uh, obviously needs some change, but I'm running with the Delver sideboard uh, for now. And I don't know if I'm ever gonna look at this again, but I figured I would uh, try it and see what happened. I'm calling this deck <laughs> Stealer, uh, and you know I very seldom brew, and I wouldn't call this brewing even. If you uh, would be really crazy and want to see this in the Pauper Gauntlet, go to the Pauper Gauntlet thing and uh, say so. There will be a link in the show notes. Let's see what we can do. My guess is that we are should do very well against... Uh, not much. <laughs> uh, well, uh, let's see. Can the control decks really stop us from ever attacking? We still have the ninjas too. So we have 16 creatures that draws cards. And we have to finish with the spy golems or the fairies. Um, wasn't there a flyer thieving magpie? It was uncommon, right? A flyer uh, or an evasion creature with this ability is really what we're missing. Shadow Mage Infiltrator is what we're missing. Okay, I want to play first. Uh, well, this looks like a hand. And none of our 16 draw card creatures. So we got the Vapor Snag, we can Cloud of Fairy spell start the next turn. Is there no fairy that draw cards? But not like this. I have all the creatures that draw cards when they hit. Delver. We are snagging him. And then we are soon revealing our total usefulness, uh, uselessness. We are casting the Cloud of Fairies, untapping. And then we are going to spell Stutter the Delver. And then what? Oh, we should have spell Stutter this Preordain, right? That's the Chris Weaver lesson. Spell Stutter the everything you see. Pretty much. But then we got to spell Stutter the Delver. And now a ninja is what we need, but we don't get one. And maybe, given that we have a lot of more three drops now, <laughs> a lot more three drops, we should be adding lands. And probably then removing excludes. So one land for one exclude seems like a good change that land could be a quicksand couldn't it and he can't do I want to keep counterspell mana up or do I want to go to town Well, excluding here will be so fun. Um, can he really raise me? Yes, he can. But I am gonna exclude. That might be the wrong decision. A vapor snag. And I might just be better off blocking this Delver now. 
Where's the thunder? I just fallen behind too much. And he would probably just be correct to race me here. And not do anything, but he's doing things. Ooh! Nice one! Now I'm really falling behind. Um and a spell start just right now will of course be devastating, but there isn't one. So we are going for the stealer that I should have gone for from the start. And had I played this two turns ago, everything would have looked much better. And let's make this Delver dead Delver. The spy golem. That's what's it. That's what it's all about, isn't it? But I've fallen behind way too much here. Well, now I have counter spell mana, so. And I have a quick stand. And I have an energy drink. So maybe I can do it. Okay. Uh, Wait a minute. We are allowing it. And we are then excluding the cloud of fairies. And suddenly things doesn't look that grim. Oh, wait a minute, we are going to cycle these guys. And he's going to hit me with the ninja, but then I'm going to counter the spy goal and then he's going to counter my counter and then he's going to win the game. I want to be doing ninja shenanigans too. He is pondering. Maybe he has a dispel. Oh, he had another one. That's a shame. So, Vapor Snag on your guy. And a Spy Golem. And you're going to return the favor, aren't you? Yes. So 
sorry for the drinking sounds. Have to stay hydrated in the Delver mirror. And now we'll counter my spy golem. Then life will be horrible. And that, sir, is how you win the Delver Mirror. Countering spy golems. It's pretty much over here. And I think I made a critical mistake, but not pushing the um, my advantage when I had it. But given that I have I'm more expensive than he is too, that's definitely a disadvantage. So uh, you're probably just better off playing normal Delver. Uh, I'm gonna sideboard out the Fidians, bringing in Serrated Arrows and Deprive. I feel that the Fidians are the weakest thing. I also still have Stitch Drake in my sideboard, so I'm bringing him in for a scroll thief or stealer for an exclude actually. And I might keep an Ophidian in for an exclude. No. That is the way I'm going to play. Ah, so much sugar in that energy drink. Sorry. That's me being disgusted, that's the sound. So now I'm disgusting you. Oh, that's a shame. And I have to keep. And uh, yeah, the stitch trick is pretty much a mulligan here. So I have four mulligan, then it's just a uh, question of time. <laughs> I will have to hard cast the ninja. <laughs> So, uh, well, that is going to be hard. That was a shame. I might even do one more match with the with the deck just to try it out. Oh my god. <laughs> wow, he he was the one to quit when I took a triple mulligan. That was really, really rude. So I go on and try to play again. Was he oh no or oh no oh? want to block him so I never ever have to play again. Ah, he's blocked. So good. I don't ever have to play him again and I don't have to have my time wasted by him. 
though when I want to fight from a triple mulligan <laughs> I should be allowed to do so don't you like winning okay Shamalama well see the problem with this deck very clearly and why didn't I put in that island for an exclude that I said I would so I wonder if he is fisher post or if he is cloud post Oh, that looks Fisher posty. <sighs> Wall of Roots. Well, he's gonna be blocking my scroll thieves all day. And uh, that will not have that. And there's a snap. And let's see if we can make scroll thief do things um uh, he will play land now oh Okay, definitely a snap again. Snap counterspell even to... Oh, he had it, so he could destroy land now. Is it snap counterspell? It might be. I think so, so I get to draw a card next turn too. Yeah, Glimmer Pose, you have 5 mana. You now have 5 mana! Um, I don't think so. But next turn he is able to hit me with nasty things. Ophidian! I'm talking about Skull Thief. I think Skull Thief is the best of these three guys. Better than Stealer of Secrets. And Ophidian is really bad. And now I'm gonna get Reap and Sowed. Which is gonna be really bad. <laughs> Skull Thief was the new development in Delver. No, he's way too expensive. I think. All these guys are way too expensive. And the trick with making this deck work is to somehow make it to 3 mana. And one good first point that I haven't done yet is to put in more mana in the deck. But this is a fairly good situation actually. Hitting here with 3 guys. What do I do with an Oryx herd now? How much mana will he have? See what I can get. He's at 20. Uh, yes, I want to use the ability. Drawing cards, living the dream. And I do want to exclude, don't I? No. I don't want to exclude. 
I want to cast another scroll thief. Please cast a crusher or an aurox herd. Or that thing. But I think I gotta save the vapor snag for crusher and aurox herd. Can't do anything about that. The question now is, do I want three cards instead of two? This It's worth spending a card, right? To get rid of the blocker, it must be worth it. Because I'm getting the card back. And this was like the theory of the deck and it seems to be working quite nicely now. So now I can counterspell, exclude, etc. I'm pretty happy with that. So I think I'm gonna try to win with what I have here. Or possibly even deck myself. Yeah, I can vapor snag you, so you are not dangerous. Tempo party. Definitely more lands. I can spell stutter for two. So I'm probably spell stuttering things. <laughs> He's still at 15. Now my arm is starting to take its toll on him. <laughs> yeah. I still get the card for Ophidian. That's broken. Uh, so I maybe... Why didn't I spell stutter? Well, I didn't think it changed a lot. I prefer to spell stutter and counter stuff that actually do things. Uh, I can spell stutter him, right? Alright, so... Against the Fisher post, we are... <laughs> he didn't want to play against me. Amazing. Okay, people apparently didn't, people didn't like this deck. Um, well, what do you think? How do we? How <laughs> how would this deck be improved? Uh, probably by just cutting everything and playing Delver instead. But if we continue playing with this thought, where where would you take this deck? Uh, you probably need to have more sideboard cards against control decks, so you can actually sideboard out both snaps and. Vapor snacks, but um, Chris liked to use the snaps to uh, only spell stat sprites. Worst case. So tell me what you think. And thank you for watching Magic Gathering Strat. I'm Dan, and I was playing the Steeler deck, and this was 
fairly casual, but uh, I like to. I like the the thought. I hope you did too. Cheers. <laughs>